Poison Hound the Spidey Bay. Poison Hound the Spidey Bay. Poison, 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 poison. Poison Hound the Spidey Bay. Spidey rules. Poison Hound the Spidey Bay. Use blinking to extend combos. Poison, 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 poison. Poison Hound the Spidey Bay. Mission starting in T minus 10 seconds. Poison around this body, What's going on, guys? It's Poison Hound here. I hope you guys are having a great day. Today, I'm coming at you guys with another Marvel video, and this is for a mods update. And yeah, this isn't sponsored, but it's uh, quote unquote sponsored by my Discord. So I actually have a mods tab here. You guys are more than welcome to join the Discord, and you know, I don't know if I'm not going to do these videos in the future, considering that I'm going to have this little tab here in my Discord where you guys can see everything I'd be talking about. But yeah, let's go ahead and just go over some things. So yeah, Hinata from Rival Schools, really cool stuff by David Hernandez or Shuma. I don't know what name they prefer. But yeah, look at, look at her go. It's amazing. Just a little bit of analyzing stuff because I did see this a little bit. So, one cool thing she has that I see is she has a non-property or non... Um, like, you know those OTGs that don't use any properties like wall bounce or ground bounce? This is amazing. So you do it that into a sys call and then this and then you do it again. It's amazing. Uh, I'm a huge, huge, huge fan of that. Like Kind of like Wesker Gunshot or you know any characters that have OTGs that don't use any properties. But yeah, really cool stuff, and I don't know if you all know, but they're also on the project with Colossus, which is amazing. Uh, shout out to David Hernandez, Shuma, or also uh, Fox. I know Fox is working on this with the help of Shuma or David Hernandez. I don't know what they prefer to be called, but yeah. And also, thank you so much for letting me beta test Colossus. Colossus is very fun. And yeah, let's go ahead and get into other mods. So another one, which is just... Uh, nice mini polishing stuff that tabs is doing is for them to have character specific intros let me kind of lower the volume so it doesn't like burst your guys's eardrums so one cool thing that i liked is you could kind of see remnants of like th these little polishing things from tabs so i don't know if you guys have ever played thanos the, you know the the clone engine mod of um of him and when he tags in a character because he was an mvci he actually says the character's name so he would say spider-man he would say uh who else is an mvci like nemesis he would say those like names because you know he has those voice lines and then if they aren't they weren't in the mvci game he would just say underling or something like that which is really cool there's like little quality of life changes that um just people notice you know it's just amazing and yeah, so they're saying specific things depending on it. But yeah, super cool stuff from Tabs. I'll make sure to put every single link in the description of all these links. Damn, my computer just like bugged out for a second. You do see Archer of Legends thing right here, or Archer O Legend. They are working on Yoon more and more. You'll see more about it in a bit, but let's go ahead and see Jimmy Chongar's Electro. Let me go ahead and just click on the link up here because I don't know why I asked for permission. But yeah, uh, I assume they're getting worked on with Nova. Shout out to Nova and Chimichangar. They are amazing modders. But yeah. There's another clip where the voice lines are actually put in from Chimichangar. And not nah, Chimichangar is doing really good with the voice lines. It's amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing work. And yeah, I'm, I'm going to also put the EX Discord along with these links of all these so you guys can give them the credit that they deserve. Let's go ahead and see which one this is. I forgot. Oh yeah, look, Doc Ock. Yeah, uh, I don't know if this was like a... Yeah, this is on April 1st. Let me go ahead and see the comments. Okay, okay, I may have lied a little bit. This is a proof of concept, which means he's doable with Custom Skeleton, maybe. Well, I'll figure it out. That's really cool. Shout out to Nova as well. Nova's a huge, huge figure in the modding community shout out to all uh, all those people that are in the modding community that aren't like posting a lot but they're still working behind the scenes so shout out to everyone and then we do have something from dante on wi-fi 
This is pretty cool. I know Moo Cartoons is also working on this as well. Shout out to Moo Cartoons. Yeah, and as you see here, this is a character. I do not want to butcher that, so shout out to that character. And look at this cool stuff. It looks like stance switches. And then you guys are going to see something cool that I thought was a crazy mechanic that I am surprised people haven't done more. So a counter that slows them down is kind of crazy. You could see them do a couple more things here. And then they also are going to show a taunt, which is amazing. Just pet the little robot. I wish I knew who these characters were. I mean, I know who Dante is, of course, but like the other character. But yeah, um, shout out to Dante on Wi-Fi and Moo Cartoons. I'll make sure to put every link in the description along with the EX Discord. And then Abomination. Yeah, Abomination is getting worked on from this amazing person right here. I don't want to butcher names, but shout out to them. Yeah, the voice lines are amazing as well. I, I'm liking, I'm liking these moves as well. A lot of those hulky like characters that are like just huge, it just makes sense to have a lot of things that Hulk has, like the Hulk Stand H or like certain supers as well. And that you can see it's like Berserker Barrage or no Berserker Slash. You can kind of see it, but with an active hitbox while running, which is pretty cool. I do not remember when he did this. <laughs> you guys can show me some random comic where he did that. I, I would assume it's placeholder though, but every yeah, it's a work in progress, guys. I do want to stress it enough. I, I can't stress it enough that everything is a work in progress. And look at that. Who's that? That's Mega Man. <laughs> it's so cool. Uh, I'm not going to lie. Out of all versions of Mega Man, I did kind of like that that version where he's like old and like, like bro gave up with everything, you know, uh, from the Street Fighter Cross Tekken. I really love that Mega Man. I'll be honest, and that'll be—I I can't, I can't wait to see. I can't wait to see whatever's out there of him. Like, look at him; looks amazing. But yeah, uh, let's go ahead and get into other stuff. This would be for Yoon, so this is why I didn't show off the Yoon uh, model because you know we're gonna see a lot of it right here. Yeah, just the animations are, are crisp. You guys are going to see. There's like a lot of animations that are usually from Yoon. And I can't wait to see what they're going to do with the supers as well. Shout out to Archero Legend. There's a lot of cool things you can pull from. I, I think I think it was Yoon. I hope I'm not like dumb. I think it was Yoon that had a skateboard. And then also with a clone super that he had in Street Fighter 4. I actually started in Street Fighter 4. And then I went into Marvel straight after. And yeah, I don't know. it's amazing. An amazing game. Shout out to Xbox Live doing that uh, free games with gold. I got the Street Fighter Arcade Edition. But yeah, really nice, crisp moves. I can't wait to see all the cool stuff that Archero Legend is going to be doing. And then we have a little update on Gene. So Gene is really cool. I would love to beta test. Please let me know, Angel Glory. I love that like slugging type of... Um, like fighting style, like kind of dirty boxing kind of thing. But it's amazing. It's like all these moves are cool as well. And then he like finished it off with a final punch. And it's amazing. But yeah, it's really, really cool. Then what is next? I think you guys are going to like this. This is Blade. Blade's getting teased by Kelly Kings. I wonder if... He's going to be shooting people with the like those moves. I wonder if they stagger because imagine you just like purposely whiffing a move so you can get them. And I can't wait to see what is going to come of Blade. Blade is just amazing. Very, very like loved character. And let's go ahead and see this. So this is from Dragonify. Shout out to Dragonify. They did do a Sakura mod in the past. It was an amazing, fun mod. And now this is Dragonify Star Lord, so I cannot wait for the cool stuff this can also mean for other characters in the future, especially with stance switches. So the cool thing about yeah, 
Looks amazing. And then you could see the jet in the background. Was that in that stage? Does anyone know if that jet was always in the background? That is so cool. Look at that. He's like, that's so cool. So I assume this is his normal version, right? And you have three different versions. Ice, fire, and electric. And looks like... Oh, wait. Was he in the stance beforehand? Or did can he just do a move that throws him into the stance? Let's see that again. Yeah, he look. He, his hands aren't blue. That is so cool. But he also, he's also doing some fire things as well. Okay, and that's the fire. Okay, I'm starting to understand it now. There's like a fire stance switch while within like the normal stance. It's just like really cool mods like this. It's just... You know, does this mean Silver Samurai could be possible? 100%. It's just 100% passion from the modders. Should anyone want to take up that project as well? And this is amazing. Super creative stuff. Yeah, look at that. I wonder if he could fly. I don't, I don't think he could fly. But I think it would be... He's cool nonetheless. Yeah, it's amazing. And he has a level 3 as well. Look at that. That is so cool. That's amazing. Yo, Drax. That's pretty cool. I cannot wait to see all these mods. Shout out to all the mod makers. I'm going to make sure to just tag every one of them in the pinned comment below or just show all these links please please check them out they do deserve all the credit that they they deserve all the credit it's basically that and uh, i do want to thank you guys so much for making it this far in the video thank you so much for watching please make sure to like subscribe hit the notification bell so you never miss out on the upload i said that kind of weird to subscribe but yeah yeah um don't be too hard on yourselves you guys are amazing and i'll catch you guys later